Welcome to the Daily Prophetic Word and the Daily Prophetic Word for Sunday the 15th of September 2019 is You are a slave. Why are you staring the whole day in this small box? Why are you a slave to your mobile phone? Don't you know that the demons hold you captive? Remember that the enemy tries to influence you and that he is the prince of the air. Demons are using technology to let you forget my ways. You are a slave. Your mobile phone takes you in a kind of spell. The whole day you watch for messages and worldly news instead to listen to my servants. That is also the reason why I am calling you out of the world in Babylon. To remove you from the influences of the enemy and his demons. You are a slave. Even when you pray to me, you cannot stop your phone, and when it rings, you stop your prayer to engage with the world. The enemy has a strong grip on you, and you are a slave in his beast system. Come out of her, my children. And this was the daily prophetic word for Sunday, the 15th of September 2019. If you look around you, my beloved brothers and sisters, followers of the past, daily sacrifices. If you look around you, you see all the people engaging with the mobile phones every second of their day, all the time, wherever they are, wherever they have a chance to look or sit on and watch and then they are on their phone. Do you know how many bad influences are coming through your mobile phone? The Satan, the devil, is the prince of the air, and he will use the mobile phone to influence you badly. All the time you are engaged in his world, not in the world of heaven, in his world. And even when you enter a church, you cannot switch it off. How many times are people in the church with running mobile phones? And it's ringing, and then they're even engaging in the church during prayer. When your mobile phone rings, you stop your prayer with the Lord, and you answer. What is this? Are you not a slave to your mobile phone? And when very soon in the year 2021, maybe a ship will be introduced that will also have internet and will do the same as your mobile phone, then you will use it even more and more and more. Do not take the mark of the beast. If you take the mark of the beast, you will lose your eternal life. You will lose your salvation. So please, brothers and sisters, do not be a slave to your technology. Do not be a slave to internet. Do not be a slave to your mobile phones. And when you pray to the Father or to Jesus Christ, then switch it off. Put it in air, airline mode so that it is off, that nothing can disturb you. The best is not to engage with it too much. Even not with Facebook, Twitter and all the other social media. They are all things where the demons will control you. And very soon you will have a very bad influence in your life. Just one loophole is enough and Satan and his forces will enter. And you will see that your life become worse and worse and worse. I hope this daily prophetic word gives you a clue how to start a new life without your mobile phone and without too much technology. If it takes over your life, you must stop it. Like every addiction, you must stop it. I see children playing the whole day video games or this Xbox things. What a terrible waste of time. What a terrible waste of time. This is the time that you should use and introduce your children to the Lord. But they are playing war games on Xbox. Please have an influence, good influence on your children. But to have a good influence on your children, you must start with yourself. Stop your mobile phones. Stop the excess use. Right now. In Jesus' name I pray. Thank you that you have listened to the Daily Prophetic Word. My name is Michael. I am the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Pass Movement Foundation. If you are willing to sow in the world, 
then please go into the links in the description box below. There you can find either PayPal or Patreon or our donor box, whatever you might use. I'm very grateful for any donation that will come through, so that will help us to make more prophetic words and to spread the societies of the rose to the whole world. Thank you. May God bless you and your family abundantly. Have a nice day and I will see you again tomorrow. Maranatha.